Hello, young math enthusiasts. Are you ready for some fun with division? Dive right into our math quiz for kids channel for exciting division challenges. And if you're ready to test your skills, give us a thumbs up and subscribe right away. Fifteen divided by five is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 15 by 5. Each group contains 5 units, so dividing 15 by 5 results in 3 equal groups. Thus, the result is 15 divided by 5 equals to 3. Twenty-seven divided by three is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number twenty-seven by three. Each group contains three units, so dividing twenty-seven by three results in nine equal groups. Thus, the result is 27 divided by 3 equals to 9. 12 divided by 2 is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 12 by 2. Each group contains 2 units, so dividing 12 by 2 results in 6 equal groups. Thus, the result is 12 divided by 2 equals to 6. 18 divided by 9 is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 18 by 9. Each group contains 9 units, so dividing 18 by 9 results in 2 equal groups. Thus, the result is 18 divided by 9 equals to 2. 24 divided by 8 is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 24 by 8. Each group contains 8 units, so dividing 24 by 8 results in 3 equal groups. Thus, the result is 24 divided by 8 equals to 3. 12 divided by 3 is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 12 by 3. Each group contains 3 units, so dividing 12 by 3 results in 4 equal groups. Thus, the result is 12 divided by 3 equals to 4. 12 divided by 4 is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 12 by 4. Each group contains 4 units, so dividing 12 by 4 results in 3 equal groups. Thus, the result is 12 divided by 4 equals to 3. 56 divided by 8 is time to think.
Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 56 by 8. Each group contains 8 units, so dividing 56 by 8 results in 7 equal groups. Thus the result is 56 divided by 8 equals to 7. What is 6 divided by 3? Picture this. You have six objects to divide into groups of three. How many groups can you form? Let's think about it. Ready to find out? Let's break it down. Imagine you have six objects. Can you picture them lined up? Now consider splitting them equally into smaller groups of three. What is 20 divided by two? Picture this. You have 20 objects to divide into groups of two. How many groups can you make? Let's think about it. Ready to find out? Let's break it down. Let's imagine you have 20 objects. Can you picture them lined up? Now, think about splitting them equally in... What is 70 divided by seven? Picture this. You have 70 objects to divide into groups of 7. How many groups can you make? Let's think about it. Ready to find out? Let's break it down. Let's imagine you have 70 objects. Can you picture them lined up? Now, think about splitting them. What is 80 divided by 8? Picture this. You have 80 objects to divide into groups of 8. How many groups can you make? Let's think about it. Ready to find out? Let's break it down. Let's imagine you have 80 objects. Can you picture them lined up? Now, think about splitting them. What is 10 divided by 2? Picture this. You have 10 objects to divide into groups of two. How many groups can you make? Let's think about it. Ready to find out? Let's break it down. Let's imagine you have 10 objects. Now think about splitting them equally into smaller groups. Fifty-four divided by six is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 54 by 6. Each group contains 6 units, so dividing 54 by 6 results in 9 equal groups. Thus, the result is 54 divided by 6 equals to 9. Thirty-five divided by seven is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number thirty-five by seven. Each group contains seven units, so dividing thirty-five by seven results in five equal groups. Thus, the result is 35 divided by 7 equals to 5. Fifty-four divided by 9 is time to think. think. 
Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 54 by 9. Each group contains 9 units, so dividing 54 by 9 results in 6 equal groups. Thus, the result is 54 divided by 9 equals to 6. divided by 6 is time to think Let let's go to the solution divide the number 30 by 6 each group contains 6 units so dividing 30 by 6 results in 5 equal groups thus the result is 30 divided by 6 equals to 5. Twenty-seven divided by 9 is... Time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 27 by 9. Each group contains 9 units, so dividing 27 by 9 results in 3 equal groups. Thus, the result is 27 divided by 9 equals to 3. 18 divided by 6 is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 18 by 6. Each group contains 6 units, so dividing 18 by 6 results in 3 equal groups. Thus, the result is 18 divided by 6 equals to 3. 25 divided by 5 is time to think. Let's go to the solution. Divide the number 25 by 5. Each group contains 5 units, so dividing 25 by 5 results in 5 equal groups. Thus, the result is 25 divided by 5 equals to 5. How many did you get right? We bet you did awesome! Remember, practice makes perfect. Don't forget to click the like button if you had fun and subscribe so you can join us for even more division quiz adventures. Let's keep the math magic alive.